This was so unexpected and uh, generous. From one of my clients, one of my current clients, Ross. Check him out. Ooh, wee! Nike ID Prestos. They're so clean. The black white specks on the heel, black bottom, black sole, the Nike ID part online. Coach. Again, thank you, Ross. This is uh, too kind. Didn't have to do this. It's been a while. I'm gonna undead stock these. I'm still getting a ton of snaps. Uh, DMs on Instagram. You guys sending me videos of you guys undead stocking your shoes. It's uh, it's pretty epic, especially because I haven't bought a pair of shoes and undead stocked them on on in a video in a long time. But here we go. Check this out, guys. Check what Burger Lounge sent me. Start my day a little earlier. Earlier than usual, I got a haircut. So I am going to, I'm gonna stop by the campus before my haircut to get kind of ahead uh, of the day. Get stuff cracking, then go get my haircut, then go home shower get ready and uh, I'm pretty excited to train today I don't know why I'm extra extra motivated today uh, push day today so I'll be hitting that with I think Sal and maybe Alex at four let's drop my key yeah so I've got accustomed to getting a haircut every week it's like uh, I don't know it's just uh it's, it's something that I, I've got used to. And the, my hairstyle, how I get it cut, if I, if I do it every two weeks, it'll just be, it won't be good. I get a pretty um, short style haircut where after a week, it, it needs some touching up already. See? <laughs> I'm more disappointed than I am mad. Thank you, sir. Next time. Man, who remembers this song? This is R&B right here. Neo. R&B is not the same. All right, guys, having a little snack. I guess it's pre-workout, still kind of early. It's a pre-workout snack. So I'm having a bagel. I just ate one half. Got this left. These Sara Lee blueberry bagels. And I'm gonna have two scoops of cereal milk, Ghost Whey, with almond milk in there. I got like 12 ounces in there. And then I did spray I don't really like too much on my, my bagels, especially like this blueberry one because it's pretty good. So I just added a little bit of this uh, fake, fake butter spray. Those are clean. You guys know I love my Prestos. It's the only thing I wear these days. Simple, comfy, and they're Nike. Thanks again, Ross, for the present. Another little snack, guys. My favorite oat, oatmeal raisin from Protein Cookie Co. Ah. The recipe is so much better now. It was good before, but it's it's that much better. It, it doesn't taste like a protein cookie. It just tastes like a regular cookie, and you're getting a good amount of protein. 
time to start sipping on the Ghost Legend. Best flavor ever. Warhead's Watermelon. I got some points in here. I'll hook you guys up with some points. Screenshot it. Do whatever you need to do. Alright, so if you guys aren't collecting those points, uh, from what I know about it, it's like a reward system. So you put the points in and you earn you earn towards free like product. I wanted to update you guys on the Arnold. I told you guys that I will be at the Arnold at the 8 booth again. And I got the booth number. It's uh, booth 608. 608 and Friday, March 3rd, the first day. I'll be there from 2 to 5.30 p.m. And then Saturday, March 4th, I will be there from 11 a.m. to 2 p.m. And then Sunday, the last day, I'll be there from 2 to 4. I'm hoping that I get to meet a lot of you guys. It's always, it's always a pleasure to meet everyone in person and you know, just talk, chat, get to know you guys. Also, keep in mind, the uh, Ape is giving out free t-shirts again. Super limited. I think it's 300 on Friday and then 500 on Saturday. So it's first come, first serve. Get to the booth. Come say what's up and get your free shirt. I look forward to meeting you guys. There you go, Sally. You guys might be asking why we never use shakers. I have a ton of ghost shakers. It's just so convenient with the water bottles. Yeah. I don't got to wash them. I hate lugging around shaker cups. You know, you just, the, you, you just lose them. You forget that they're in your car and they just get nasty. Uh, we do recycle here, so <laughs> water bottles. Yeah, I don't Stacking the Ghost Legend with some Starburst gummies. And I get a lot of you guys that still ask me why the candy pre and intra. Simple answer, it's just carbs. The intra carbs. Uh, simple carbs from the sugar. I don't eat candy throughout the day. I'm not a candy like holic. It may seem like it because I do it every day, but it's seriously in moderation. Like, I don't even have this whole pack majority of the time. And when I do start cut, counting macros, I'm still going to fit it in. I'm not going to cut it out. It's just going to, I'm going to have a lot less. I'm not going to have the luxury of just eating however I, however I want to, how I want to, how much I want to. But yes, so sugar, simple carbs, fuel your workout a little bit. It's not like crucial, it's not necessary, but why not? It's candy, it's good. Ah, look what I did, I, I was sitting right here. You gotta get too excited. And I spilled my legend all over my lap. And again, I'm proud to say to let you guys know that sleeveless, no sleeves, 
or wrist wraps, just chalk. Question today. I think it was on Snapchat or Instagram. I can't remember. But the, the question was when you're benching, is a bar supposed to touch where your nipples are or below? And there's no exact answer for each person. It's going to be different based on the individual, based on, I would say, your arm length, how much arch you use in your bench form. Pretty much, you don't wanna really think where the bar lands. It's more of like your, your bar pass with the your shoulders, your tuck. So you don't wanna be too flared out like this. It's gonna put some pain, bring some pain to your, your shoulders. And you don't wanna be too tucked in like this. You wanna find your nice, sweet spot right in between. I think with with my, my form, my technique on bench, it touches right, right at my nipple, I think. Or slightly below. Alright, set three. Depending on how fast these are, I think we may go a full set. Just to get more volume in. I say what's up to YouTube. What's up to the vlog. <laughs> I'm so screwed up in schedule right now. My 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 brain my, my mind is just foggy. I thought today was Monday. I thought today was Monday, so yeah, I thought it was an upper day. I think I was talking about that on live, on YouTube Live. Yeah, you were. <laughs> so today is just a push day. <laughs> it was like a back. I was dreading today because I thought it was going to be yeah. a long day. Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. So what we did after bench, I don't know if I turn on the camera. We, uh, we did bench, incline. incline, we did three sets, four sets? Four sets. Four. We did incline four sets of eight to 12 reps. Yeah. I did the hundreds for sets of 10, and then we did lateral raises for four sets, and then rear delt fly for four sets, eight to 12, and now we are gonna do, let's do some flies. Okay. We'll see what set flies and um, some uh, triceps.
Give him a good try. A good try is the left side. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> a good side. There you go. It just was the front gate. I thank God. The pills for causing money. How many shots does it take to start the game? I can tell by your dream dream you had a long game. Woo, it's chilly. All right, guys, getting a post-workout meal. Pretty sure you can guess where we're at. Who's this guy following me? I don't know. Hungry, bro. Follow me? Yeah, hungry. All right, guys, so I went with the lounge burger. American cheese, no Thousand Island, so no sauce, and fries. So I may or may not be tracking macros right now. I may be easing myself into it. I'm just kind of getting a, just get, just practice mode, trial mode of tracking my macros again and, and fitting in my good stuff. So I'm not gonna cut out burger line if I do decide to cut, there's ways around it. And when I do enter a cut, I'm gonna share with you the tips and tricks I have to making dieting, being in a deficit, better. Not as bad, not torture. So here's the lounge burger. Still good size. Said there's no Thousand Island, which saves you 11 grams of fat. Yep. And then fries. Excellent. Sally got the same thing. Let's do this. You good? Say grace. <laughs> this song is sick. I actually like this new Lincoln Park. All right, guys, finishing off the night with a couple icon meals. I got the brisket sliders and uh, chipotle lime chicken. Macros on the sliders, 42 protein, 47 carbs, 8 fat, and the uh, chicken, 40 protein, 49 carbs, and 8 fat. So two fairly lean meals. Good amount of carbs, good amount of protein. Watch a little bit of TV and then go to bed. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like the video if you liked the video, if you learned something, if you enjoyed it. Share the video and subscribe if you haven't already. See you guys tomorrow. Peace.